If I can say one thing to Jocelyn, I would say pull up. Let me pull up. I got a nigga for her nigga. I got security for her security. And I just want I, I want you to I want I want to show her how I feel to really get her ass beat by a bitch that's really gonna beat your ass out here. I um, she, Jocelyn don't understand her position. You feel me? Sometimes you put you put people in position and they just don't understand it. Like she doesn't understand she's a hoe. She be giving her feelings too much about shit. You gotta keep your feelings out of out of stuff. Mm -hmm. And that's what she be doing. But I don't think it's appropriate for her to be kicking bitches in their ribs and stuff like that. But I be in Miami all the time and I be ready to pull up on this bitch on a ski boat. Like <laughs> on Jocelyn <laughs> on a jet ski, like damn. yeah, like because like, I supported what she thought she had going on, right. but it's like at a certain point in time, it's like damn, like don't you ain't gotta do all that. Like let if you want if you got bitches that's gonna back you up, let the bitches back you up. Like yeah. I feel like Jocelyn need to stay in her position to stay ahead of shit instead of mixing herself into the into the into the, the pit. drama. Yeah. Okay, and yeah. Then, so, Hi guys, I hope you could and thank you so much for taking your precious time to join me. Well, those are the interviews that I believe that they might have triggered Jocelyn Hernandez. Well, recently or yesterday, Floyd Mayweather had a boxing match while he was busy throwing punches. Jocelyn backstage was busy throwing hands at everyone, but mostly she was targeting Big Lex, who used to be part of her show, Jocelyn's Cabaret. Guys, and now she has been arrested and charged for uh, with four counts related to this incident. What do you think about this? Do certainly share your thoughts in the comment section below. I love you so much and continue to stay blessed. Salute.